Okay, so we're pretty sure that today is the day. My water broke at pretty much exactly 8 a.m. today, so we're about to go to the hospital. How's everybody feeling? Yay! Excited. We're so excited! <laughs> Here we go. Hey guys, what's going on? Baby. We're having a baby. baby. Hi, Last Alice. time seeing me pregnant. <laughs> At least with Alice. Okay. Alrighty. Let's do it. I love you guys. Go. Uh, Emma is in triage having contractions. They're gonna test her fluid. <laughs> So they just confirmed that my amniotic sac has ruptured for sure. Um, that's his heartbeat. Um, they are in the process of getting me a actual delivery room. Um, I'm a centimeter and a half dilated, so did a little bit of more work. Still 80% effaced. I'm having a contraction at the moment, so I'm gonna let you go. So this is gonna be the labor and delivery room. This is where she's gonna push out a baby out of there. <laughs> <laughs> now, if I've been in active labor since eight, then it's been like five and a half hours. Robert, you're about to be a dad. About to be. How are you feeling? Good. Good? Here, look at me, get off your phone. <laughs> Are you so excited? <laughs> you look so tired. <laughs> um, it's almost two o'clock. Emma's uh, contracting. How does that make you feel? Happy and uncomfortable at the same time. Sometimes it's really bad, sometimes it's okay. There's other times where I just want to, but not really. Uh, they just asked you about your suicidal thoughts. I'm not, so. I'm not. <laughs> One last video of the belly. In an active contraction. He actually has hiccups right there, down there. Probably can't see it. That's okay. Yeah, I just want to point out that here I am in better. labor. <laughs> and here's, here's dad about to load. Let me see your computer screen. No. Let me see your computer screen. I don't know what you're talking about. Let what computer? He's about to play Roblox well, Mining see. Simulator <laughs> while I am here having contractions. <sighs> well, you see. Yep, that's it. Oh my goodness. You're so supportive. Supportive. <laughs> uh, baby's heart rate, uh, the taco, um, all that other good stuff, and then <laughs> contraction diagram chart. Mountains. Are the bottom. Well, I I thought it was the the Rocky Mountains. <laughs> if you look at it this way, the way that the trajectory runs. Oh, I'm just kidding. I hurt. I'm thinking about getting some fentanyl or however you say it soon because it's been seven hours you're getting really close to me very this is very uncomfortable but it's been like seven eight ish seven and eight ish hours of labor why are you gonna be so close could have been at the house chilling no no my water broke why'd you break it felt like well, apparently he might have pooped in me anyway, so maybe it just was too much pressure with all the poop in there. Poop baby. <laughs> you gotta move out of my way, fool. Wide load. I know. Beep. 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 Pitocin and uh, some fentanyl to help with pain. She's yeah. almost ready for <laughs> epidural soon. an epidural. epidural. 
feel high, but in a good way. I enjoy mm -hmm. the pain medicine. It's very nice. <laughs> All right. Okay, it's about 7.17. No baby yet, but I'm going to show you where he's going to be. And we are having a waiting game now. There's a pretty mama. And Emma is 3 centimeters dilated, 90% effaced. She's had her epidural now, so that Pitocin had kicked in earlier today. Yeah. It was strong. So how are you doing now, sweetheart? Way better. I had about maybe two or three hours of Pitocin without the epidural and I was able to use, I got three things of fentanyl which helped maybe three contractions. Um, just I, My advice to my future self by the way is just get the epidural immediately because <laughs> it's amazing. Um, but I've, yeah, I've been, I've been doing a lot better. Like I feel pretty comfortable. My only complaint is I'm itchy. <laughs> yeah, totally normal. We're here, dad's waiting. Hey, Roberto. Hey, hey. There you go. So now it's just a waiting game. Sometime between now and oh, maybe the next 12 hours or so, we're going to have a little baby. Yeah, yeah. I just <laughs> want you out of me, Dallas. I want to meet you and hold you. And you pooped in me, so thank That's you. That's noteworthy yeah. as well. Yeah, so if you get a little bit of my poo on you, it's fair. There you go. All right, signing off for now. See you again soon. Okay, 10.15 p.m. Emma's been in labor for about 14 hours. No baby yet. Here we go. Here's little mama. And they have got her way up there, her leg up there, trying to kind of open up her hips a little bit. Contractions are good. We've got extra monitors on her now. And what do you have to say about this? I hope I don't need a C-section. But obviously, if that's what's needed, I'll do it. But hopefully, they, they upped my Pitocin, so hopefully my contractions kind of regulate a little bit more, and they are strong enough to dilate me more, and hopefully we'll be able to have a baby in the next couple hours. Yeah, and baby's doing good in there. He's got some good heartbeats going there. He's doing good. And back to Mama again. And there's Dad right there. Yes, he is sleeping because he only had two hours of sleep last night. So we're letting him get all the rest he can while he can. <laughs> See you again soon. 12.25-ish a.m. So it's, what's the date? The 28th then, September 28th. So it looks like September 28th is going to be the day. Like so Emma's got a little bit of an update. So what's the news, my dear? Um, I have dilated more, three and a half, but so before she, how she explained it is she could put one finger in my cervix, so not quite the second one, but now she can go like this. Woohoo! Um, so that hopefully means that we'll be able to do a vaginal delivery. And Fingers crossed. Yeah, I would, I'm just rooting for it. <laughs> yeah. Good job, honey. You're doing good. You need to try to get some rest here soon, okay? I shall try. You're going to need it. Love you. Love you. <laughs> okay, it is Tuesday, September 28th. It's about 10.50. And as you can see, no baby yet. Dad's applying some pressure to Mama's lower back. She's dilated at 8. Still getting epidurals. Looks like we got a fresh one coming in, so we'll check in in a bit. 2.35 on Tuesday the 28th. Still no baby yet. But we're getting ready because somebody's fully dilated to a 10. I'm already yeah. crying tears of joy. Dad's eating a quick lunch. Tears of joy. This is the first actual smile I've seen on Emma's face for like over 24 hours. Yeah. How are you feeling right now, honey? Excited. Yeah? Yeah. Like, it's just like a massive, massive relief knowing that it's like it's only going to be a couple hours. Max. It could be less than that, you know. Yeah? 
And it's funny because it's actually International Sons Day today. So. Well, that is apropos. Yeah. I'm so excited. Well, the next video may be with a baby in your arms. <laughs> Best advice for pushing? Push, Push hard. hard. <laughs> hey, Emma. Ready to have a baby? Yes, I am. All right. Here we go. Hey, Robert. Yeah. Ready to have a baby? Ready? Oh, here we go, Em. Here we go, Em. Here we go, honey. Doing good. It's a way. Let it out, let it out, let it out. Pushing you can or do you want to go next to the camera? Yep, yep, yep. In dreams you will lose your heart. Push, 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 push. Whatever you wish for, you can. Just met you. Seems like yesterday. You opened up your eyes, and I recognized your face. You know that you're the one that we've been waiting for. We're gonna keep you safe. First time I held you in my arms, I knew I'd love you all the way. I took you in at night Another day has passed Every week goes by a little faster than the last It wasn't so long ago We walked together and you held my hand But now you're getting too big to want to But I hope you'll always understand That I'm was gonna lift you up And I'm never gonna let you down No matter what you do I'm forever proud of you I love you forever now Through your Postpartum. ears I hear it, There's through mama. your eyes I see A world French, full of magic, full of possibility yeah. You know as well as anybody how tough it. this life can be But you've got so much strength inside you A strength I pray you'll never need and Baby Dallas and Gonna lift you up. Sure, and I'm never gonna let you down. <laughs> Time flies <laughs> by. I hope you realize that I love you forever now. I'm always gonna. Me. I'm always gonna have yes. you. <laughs> 
you. <laughs> hey, we're on our way home. We're leaving the hospital on September 30th. There's dad, there's Mima, there's mama. And here's little baby Dallas on his way home. We're moving and grooving. Love you forever now I love you forever